Hi guys, welcome to this video. In this video, as we do with all the other videos in this series, we analyze the IPL match between Kings 11 Punjab and Royal Challengers Bangalore. This is our Word Pandit Premier League where we correlate cricket with words. That's what we do. Help you learn words through these contexts, right? So that's what we do. Uh, to get things started, first things first, it's a really, really, it's a happy day for me today. My team won, Kings 11 Punjab, I am a Punjabi, I live in Chandigarh and we do support Kings 11 Punjab out here. Uh, the display of Kings 11 Punjab was something that warmed our hearts and it was an imperious display, right? Massive, massive defeat for the RCB. Uh, Kings 11 Punjab almost ticked all the boxes in tonight's performance, right? So you would call tonight's performance an imperious performance. Imperious refers to something which is marked by arrogant assurance, something which is dominating, uh, something which is characteristic of an eminent rank, attainments, or something which is intensely compelling as was tonight's performance by Kings 11 Punjab and KL Rahul. He got a little bit of luck towards his end, but as you say in the game of cricket, you make your own luck. Uh, and he did, he did deserve that, right? But it was all in all a pretty, pretty swaggering performance. It was a supercilious performance, full of pride, disdainful, haughty, lordly, overbearing. These are all the sentiments that RCB would have felt today, right? Uh, so I just read around some of the comments which are floating around the match. In fact, RCB was not even even able to beat KL Rahul's 132, right? They were not even able to leave alone Kings 11 Punjab. They were not able to beat KL Rahul's score. So that's the kind of imperious form that KL Rahul was in and the kind of wretched display that RCB came up with. RCB's display can be called crummy at best today. Very, very unpleasant, poor quality, bad, deficient, defective, faulty, imperfect, mediocre inadequate all the terrible words in the world right you can correlate rcb's performance very very crummy performance last couple of days we've had a couple of one-sided matches right uh we'd been having some close calls but now all of a sudden we start getting these un uh, one-sided matches make sure things about think about the team tactics as well the team compositions uh one thing for sure kings 11 punjab got it absolutely right as Cute moves, right? Like the perfect moves in the game of chess, especially when you want to keep in mind here the context as well. Effectively, this is Anil Kumble's team which came up against Kohli's team, and there is no love lost between the two after Kumble's unceremonious exit at India's coach. And this game also makes you think that the kind of tactics that are uh, that Kings Eleven have been using and they've come up with team selection, team composition, etc., etc. What if Kumble had been India's coach, right? So there will always be that what if what if he'd stayed longer what if uh, we he had had his way right we would never know the answer to that question for sure but uh, we can definitely say that uh, Kings 11 Punjab were very astute they were able to assess situations they were able to pick the right team couple of leg spinners today right Bishnoi and Ashwin both did a good job right shoot selection sharp razor sharp acute quick tactics used right uh, Dhoni is another astute tactician you want to keep in mind astute cricket pain he's known to have an astute cricket brain right and you can remember this word astute as something who's very very sharp uh, the person who has the ability to assess the situations unfortunately R uh, RCB today were not astute at all as with all the teams so far in the competition, they've been winning the toss and electing to field. And other than uh, we've hardly had any sides winning, chasing. In the first game, CSK did win while chasing. But other than that, it's been one-way traffic. And teams that have batted first have actually won matches. Probably the wickets are slowing down. Probably that's why team tactics are going wrong. Uh, Teams want to chase because of the due factor, but in the end, they're coming up short, right? So maybe we'll see a change in team tactics. As far as Kings 11 Punjab goes, their astute tactics are all working. Probably the one thing that they are missing out right now and something that they'll be hoping for is some Maxwell magic. He's been pretty disappointing for the first couple of games. We just hope he gets his act together as well. And once you've got Maxwell magic added into the mix here, uh, it, it, Kings 11 Punjab do make a very compelling case for them. It's a compelling package that we have this year. So let's see. Let's hope uh, as the season unfolds, we'll get to we'll get to learn more about Kings 11 Punjab. Thank you very much for watching this video. As always, you can reach out to, to us on these numbers if you've got any questions and if you want to connect with us. Thank you very much for watching this video and happy learning.